It's game over for business operating skill games after a judge dismissed a case challenging Virginia's ban on skill games. Business owners could now face both civil and criminal charges. The wildly popular games you see in gas stations and restaurants bring in a big boost for many businesses. After two years of legal battles, you can be charged now with a misdemeanor for playing them or for operators, it's a felony. They could get hit with a $25,000 fine for each machine and up to five years in prison. We're going to hurt too many mom and pop operators in Virginia. But we want to be taxed fairly and um, we want to be included in these laws. And we can bring the Commonwealth of Virginia at least um, 200, 300, 400 million dollars a year in tax revenue from these machines. And not all cities are enforcing that ban. Melkor says Virginia Beach, for example, gave operators until November 26. From skill games to casinos, we are learning Rivers Casino Portsmouth had its lowest gross gaming revenue since it opened in January. The Lottery Commission says the casino took in $20 million in October, about $1.2 million of that going directly to Portsmouth. We also noticed that Rivers has also added about 40 slots since it opened.